Welcome to this Superimpose X tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you how to create the little planet effect. I have this photo loaded into the project. Let me go to editor and then distort. And here we have this planet effect. The photo is now converted into a round planet. We have quite a few settings here. However, you do not need to use all these settings for every project. But knowing the settings can really help. The first one here zooms into the image. After a certain point, it brings inside out of the photo to give it a completely different look. And finally, it zooms back into the original state. The second one is called gravity. It controls how much the surrounding gets pulled into the center of the planet. The size, is to control the size of the planet. Rotate, as the name suggests, rotates the whole planet. Fade, controls how much portion of the edge of the image, is used to wrap, to the other side of it. Here you can see that one side of the image is getting merged into the other. This is useful in blurring out rough edges, if there is any. Using the twist settings, you can try to match the horizon of one side of the image to the other side. In this particular image, it is already matching, so I do not need to change it. Let me accept the edits. This effect typically looks good when the image is a perfect square. Superimpose X does not crop the image to make it square automatically. But you can do it here, under Layers section, where we have the Crop Project option. Let me select Square Aspect Ratio. This looks cool. Let me save it. And now, I am going to show you some more examples. Here I have a city skyline. It looks like the city is actually a tiny planet. Let me change some settings. Okay, I think it is looking good. And now, I am going to crop it, to make it a square. And finally, save it. Let me try the effect on this image. In this example, the twist option is really helping me in matching the horizons. And now let me crop it. This is really a very beautiful green planet. And finally, we will use this photo, to create an, inside out, planet effect. Let me zoom it all the way, to make it, inside out. And now, let me rotate it. This looks interesting. That is all in this tutorial. I hope you found it useful. Thank you for watching.